Hi, I'm Heather Demetrius, and I'm the author of Something Real. My inspiration for writing Something Real was a magazine cover that I saw when I was at the grocery store, and it was like this one, which is a People magazine, a tabloid that you're probably familiar with, and it had Kate Goslin and her kids from John and Kate Plus 8 on the cover. So I saw this cover and immediately thought, what would it be like to be a kid who grows up on reality TV? And what would it be like to have people in your house all the time, people filming you while you throw a tantrum, people filming you at your worst moments, and even just your boring life. And I thought, what would it be like if you went to school someday when the show is over and your friends could download your childhood basically and they could see all of these embarrassing things that happened to you and also what would it be like just to live your life in front of the camera and you're always watching yourself. And so I had never really seen the show. I'd heard of it, I'd seen clips of it like on YouTube, but um, when I saw this magazine cover, I thought I have to write a book about this. And so then I did start to watch a few episodes of the show. So I would say the show John and Kate Plus 8, but specifically that magazine cover was my biggest inspiration for something real. Chloe, also known as Bonnie, is the main character of the book and she was really interesting to me um, as a character because this is a girl who was literally born on television and there's a lot of different layers to her and I think she's got these different personas. There's the Bonnie slash Chloe who's on camera, so the girl that all of America's watching and she, you know, is very aware that she's being filmed. And then there's the girl who's at school before anyone knows she's a reality star who's trying to just attract as little attention as possible. And then there's this girl who kind of grows up over the course of the novel and becomes this kind of feisty, gutsy girl who really wants to take a stand and, and kind of fight for herself. So she, she was really interesting and grew a lot, I thought. I think my favorite thing about writing something real was that as soon as I started writing it, the whole plot just came to me, which never happens. And so that was really exciting. I knew the story so well from the very beginning, and then it was mostly just getting to write it and having fun with it. 